if users are trying to access the SaaS system and the public group will not allow them to access specific components or address their needs, it is uh, necessary for the administrator to go into SAS Management Console and create a user account for that individual. What the SAS administrator will need to do is go into User Manager, select New User, and then type in the name of the new user. They can then move to Groups and assign a specific group for this individual to be a member of. I will make uh, myself a Web Report Studio uh, report consumer in this instance. And for logins, uh, for host authentication, it's fairly simple. You can enter the username uh, as it exists for that uh, user account on the host and select OK. Uh, what SAS will do is retrieve that password from uh, the host authentication module. For other types of authentication, you can put in the, the domain slash the username, uh, similar to this mechanism. Um, also, you'll note you can have more than one authentication domain. This is useful if you have a domain uh, authentication domain for Oracle, for instance. Uh, you can place all of that information for that user here. Additional information about establishing a new user is found in the SAS online documentation. If you go to SAS Online Documentation and select SAS Intelligent Platform and Administration, you'll note that the Security Administration Guide has two uh, sections under Identity Management, the User and Group Management and the User ID and Password Management. This is extremely useful to understand how to create a user and how to manage that user for your specific environment.